Kim Kardashian has faced huge backlash for promoting an appetite-suppressing lollipop. The reality star, 37, shared a snap of herself tucking into the treat on Instagram and encouraged her 111 million followers to purchase the product, in order to aid weight loss. However, the post was immediately met with criticism, with presenter Jamila Jamil branding Kim a terrible and toxic influence, for failing to promote healthy eating. The controversial snap sees a seemingly naked Kim sucking on the red lollipop for the camera. Proving to be a fan of the diet sweet, she wrote excitedly in the caption, You guys! At Flat Umiko just dropped a new product. Their appetite suppressants lollipops and they're literally unreal. They're giving the first 500 people on their website 15% off so if you want to get your hands on some. You need to do it quick. Hashtag suck it. However the advertisement immediately came under fire from followers, with former T4 presenter Jamila leading the complaints. Addressing Kim directly, she wrote fiercely on Twitter, No, F off. No, you terrible and toxic influence on young girls. I admire their mother's branding capabilities, she is an exploitative but innovative genius. However this family makes me feel actual despair over what women are reduced to. Maybe don't take appetite suppressors and eat enough to fuel your brain and work hard and be successful. And to play with your kids. And to have fun with your friends. And to have something to say about your life at the end. Other than I had a flat stomach. Her sentiment was echoed by many, with one commenting on Jamila's response. Can't believe this is actually real. While another added, what kind of mother would advertise appetite suppressants? Jesus Christ they're money hungry. Another fan chimed in, as a mother this terrifies me, as a woman this boils my blood. Disgusting. No wonder people struggle so much when s like this is rammed down your throat. Calls herself a role model? While another added in despair, I hope this isn't real. This woman has far too much influence over young girls and seems incapable of using it in a positive way. Dot. Meanwhile Kim's post itself was flooded with critical comments from her followers, who branded the ad disgusting and irresponsible. One wrote, This is absolutely disgusting. What a horrible message to send to you impressionable and young female followers. Have you no shame? While others added, Shouldn't you be encouraging body image positivity instead of encouraging your followers to have appetite suppressants? How sad. This is not okay. What a way to use your celebrity status to promote dieting and disordered eating behaviors. Shameful. And, this is a such a dangerous message to be sending from someone in a position such as yours. The post was also deemed irresponsible by professionals with leading Harley Street nutritionist Rhiannon Lambert urging Kim to be more aware of her huge and often impressionable following. She told Mail Online, when these celebs start promoting unhealthy behaviors, they can be taken very seriously by some people which may encourage or lead to disordered eating and an unhealthy relationship with food. It is incredibly sad to see posts that are liked by so many individuals going against everything we as nutritionists are trying so hard to fight. Products such as appetite suppressants have no place in a well-balanced diet. Kim is known for her presence on social media, sharing both personal posts as well as sponsored content almost daily. Last year Michael Heller, CEO of the talent firm that organizes the family's endorsements, told Us Weekly that Kim earns close to $500,000 per Instagram ad while her sisters Chloe and Courtney can bag up to $250,000. It is not the first time Kim has faced backlash for her online activity, having come under fire for sharing a string of nearly naked snaps in February. Kim, who is known to have had plastic surgery, was criticized by public figures and fans alike for promoting an unrealistic body image to young girls, and encouraging them to also pose in the nude online. However, the reality star appeared to hit back at haters by sharing a snap of herself on the phone a week later, captioned, Hi, can I get 0FS please, thanks. Dot. 